Hi guys, my name's Danielle Collins and I'm the world leading face yoga expert and best selling author of the book Danielle Collins Face Yoga. So we're going to take our index fingers and just come between the eyebrows. Now this is excellent for helping to release and reduce stress and tension. We're stimulating an acupressure point which is renowned for helping reduce stress. This point is also beautiful for just helping you to sleep a little better and from an aesthetic point of view it really does help to relax the procerus muscle. So that's a big muscle that just fans up here between the eyebrows and when we hold a lot of tension in that muscle we tend to pull this area in which creates those number 11 lines. So by regularly massaging this area we help to reduce and prevent build up of those lines and it's also very very good just for helping to boost the circulation so we're helping all the fresh blood and nutrients and oxygen just come to the skin surface we're going to take all our fingers now and just sweep across the forehead and lift off so sweeping across and lifting off Again, it's very gentle, great for the circulation, great for helping to promote the collagen and the elastin in the skin. And once again, it helps to really release any tension. And when we're releasing tension here, we really help to soften and prevent expression lines. So with this one in particular, helping to prevent those horizontal expression lines. The more we can try and train our face to express more with our eyes and less with our forehead, the less lines you'll find that you get in this area and the more open your eye area will be. And let's just finish with a massage technique. So just going to tap all the way over the neck area. <clears throat> nice and gently working with boosting the blood flow so you slightly tilt the head back again. And then just tap underneath this area, helping with that circulation, brightening the skin, helping to boost the collagen and the elastin in this area. Then just stroking up and just bring your hands gently down. And a few of my top tips to keep this neck area looking firm and lifted are doing your daily face yoga, of course, always wearing a sunscreen of SPF 30 or above on the neck area, and of course the face and the collotage area as well. Making sure you remember to moisturize this air in the neck. It's very easy to forget that but before bed in particular, and if you can do it in the morning under your sunscreen as well, that will really help. Posture is really important for a good neck. So just bringing your phone up to this sort of level when you're looking at it, rather than just bringing your chin down. This really creases the neck, actually makes the skin very saggy here. So holding your neck up higher helps a lot in that way. Also just being aware of tension you're holding in your shoulders. Just keep the shoulders in a nice neutral position and be aware of your posture. Also taking steps to reduce stress is important. If we're having a lot of stress, then we actually can break down the collagen and elastin in our skin, those plumping agents. So taking time each day to relax is important as well. Drinking lots of water, trying to reduce things like sugar and caffeine and alcohol are really important as well. And of course, staying out the sun. So using that SPF, wearing a hat, trying to shade this area from the sun is super important as well.